Tumile Masire will lie in state at the country's parliament building in Khabarone today to allow the public to pay their last respects. Masire died last week at the age of 91. He'll be buried at his home village of Kanya on Thursday. Now, for more on the events that are planned in Botswana's capital today, we now cross to our reporter there, Ntakwana Ngatane in Khabarone. Very good morning to Ntakwana. I guess today, with the viewing of the body, it's going to be a difficult time for the people of Botswana. Indeed, Peter, he has already arrived here at the parliament precinct. Se Kitumile Kwet Joni Masire has arrived at a place where he spent most of his political life. He would have come to this precinct at the center of which is the building of parliament. Behind here is the office of the president and towards my right is the Ministry of Finance and several other government departments that are housed here in this precinct. He would have first come as the Secretary General of the Botswana Democratic Party. He would have even eventually uh, spent his time here in Parliament as the president from 1980 to 1998. So all of this is a walk through Rema Sire's life as the president of Botswana, as the father of the Botswana and a man whom many here will remember as having made a huge difference in the lives of Botswana and the lives of Botswana. So we are here at the parliament precinct where his body has already arrived. The casket is already here. He's lying in state. People have come in. The family has come through. Uh, the daughters, the sons, the granddaughters and the grandchildren have come. Um, they have also uh, been here to see him, to have been the first to see um, him lying in state well before anybody else can come uh, to, this, to this area. Peter? Ntakwana, thank you very much indeed. Uh, she's uh, keeping an eye for us on the uh, proceedings that are taking place in Botswana as the country says farewell to Sekitumile Masira who died last week at the age of 91.